going on everybody Z here welcome back to starbase and today we are going to be checking out our base building that we did in the live stream if you missed it don't worry we're going to cover it right now or if you want you can go back and check it out it was an absolutely fantastic time but we're going to log in and we're going to hope that our starbase is there because when we started the stream our starbase actually was disappearing <laughs> right to before our very eyes so we're going to log in and hope that it's still here oh it's still here is all of it still here it's all still here oh, oh it's so exciting all right so um here is our starbase uh i'm sorry i can't do anything about the lighting i don't know if there's actually any lighting modules for the starbases yet however here is our starbase oh my gosh it's exciting and it's still here i'm so happy so we've got um we kind of went with we were we weren't gonna build a cube uh, but with how things are kind of going you know with like you know testing stuff make sure things are working we're just gonna keep it you know super simple functional uh it's gonna be function over form but down here essentially we started making like a hangar kind of place to uh to park our ships so we're just putting some you know basic uh basic beams and whatnots down so that way we can park our ships in here and this is kind of like a parking area then up here um we're going to have our factory there's gonna be a factory floor in here i don't know if factories are implemented yet i don't believe they are um and then these right here these were basically just um i put these up because these were like my choices for beams and i kind of wanted to see what they all looked like in person you know what i mean so i just set these up here as vi basically like a, a visual gallery if you will so we got that going but yes we got things to do so um hopefully you guys enjoy if you do make sure you leave a like if you're new here don't forget to subscribe as well for some more uh let's go ahead and i'm going to answer a couple questions right off the bat because i was getting a lot of comments a lot of questions during the live stream and i want to kind of like roll it up as quick as i can and just get it addressed and done and out of the way so for the advanced research for the station okay there's two sides um there's this side right here which is what you have to get to get your station this is the this is the foundation and then you have these basic frames and basic block modules now these are modules so think of these as a prefab combined already together kind of thing okay so you know how with your ship right when you went through the tutorial it told you to get the four ore crates and attach it to the ship well that is what these are these are combined so these as you can see these are all prefabbed however each one of these is an individual beam so on the right hand side we have beams and plates so these are like the raw components the individuals the you know craft anything you want these are the modules these have to be built in easy build mode these are built outside of easy build mode if that makes sense because a lot of people were saying oh i need to weld all my stuff well these modules quote unquote are supposed to weld themselves on when you're in easy build mode actually let's swap to the other side because it's like lit up over here <laughs> we can actually got to see like what the heck's going on uh eh. there we go so these modules are supposed to weld themselves in because there was a lot of confusion about that so um i'm using modules i'm not getting super fancy i'm not making my own stuff right now maybe in the future we will but right now i'm not gonna do it anyways moving on from that what are we doing today well we're gonna check out the factory hall because this supposedly this is not implemented yet however i still want to check it out i still want to build it and i still want to get it going because this i believe is where you're supposed to bolt down your crafting benches and things like that so we're gonna go ahead we're gonna unlock this as you see i have a bunch of research points um these research points right here you get from crafting like you know a bajillion of these things so we're gonna go ahead we're gonna unlock that um and we're gonna wait i'm not gonna unlock anything else yet I want to see this factory hall stuff. I want to see what it requires. Uh, let's see. Let's go in here. Let's go to station modules. Oh, uh, station. Oh, factory modules. Here we go. Okay. So we need a G a, a Gisium. What is that? Factory hall module. Create a factory hall by using factory hall corners and edges once the hall is finished a factory area is formed inside the hall if you deconstruct the hall the factory area disappears also you can use a bolt tool cable tool and pipe tool inside the factory area and attach and operate data devices station owner decides who has access to factory halls in their station okay so we need to get some valkite uh chardoni charodium charodium and agesium do we even have 
Have we have we found Agisium, uh, the Agisium yet? I don't know if that I have. Um, that's gonna be interesting. Okay, that's gonna be very interesting. Factory Hall Ramp Z. Oh, we have Factory Hall Ramps? Uh, let's craft those. I wanna see what these are. Okay, uh, we're gonna switch back to the dark side now. <laughs> don't worry, the sun will come around eventually. It just probably won't happen while I'm recording. <laughs> this is my life. All right, let's go into easy build mode on. And let's grab a ramp. I want to see what this does. So zero. Oh, they're like super teeny tiny. Oh, this is super cool. Okay, so one, two. Hold on, I want another one. We want one more. I need another one. Okay, there's that one. All right, so a factory hall edge beam. Factory hall flat. Factory hall edge. Okay, so I think what we have to do is we have to create a box. We basically have to frame out a box with these factory hall pieces. Oh, that's super cool. I really like that. I like that. I think that's super neat. All right, so um, we're going to have to figure out what we need here because I don't have that agesium a, a, a stuff. I don't have this. And I don't know where that's at. And the primary, the primary material is the charodium. The Valkyte we can get into charodium, we can get around here, no problem. I'm trying to decide, maybe we should just grab some stuff, take it back and sell it, and then just buy. Well, because how much, am I, how much am I gonna need of it though? See, I'm gonna need quite a bit because I mean, even the floors. How much money do I have? I don't think I have very much money right now either. Uh, I keep hitting tab instead of inventory. 2,000. Uh, we could sell these for about 5,000 a stack. All right, so let's do this. Let's hop in the ship. Um, let's take, you know what? We're gonna take the, we're gonna take the char, charodium, char, charodium, the char. We're gonna take the char. <laughs> we're gonna take the char with us. And Transfer or transfer all charred do not even order the ship. Okay. We're gonna take this with us. Now I know what you're saying. I know you're like, oh well, this is like the main crafting material. What are you doing? This is the stuff that's worth the most for me right now. Actually, let's go ahead and transfer. Let's transfer everything we can to the ship. Okay. And then we'll just sell what we can. Um, we're out here, we can gather up everything else. And uh, we'll try to get some of that at a G Agesium stuff, but ooh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how expensive it's going to be. It's an ore that I haven't seen before. So, uh, all right. Station 21. Where are you? Uh, turn down the shut off. Let's see. Where are you? Oh, okay. All right. Let's head out of here real quick. Out we go. Origin 21. Where are you? It's got to be like right here. Wow, I can't actually see Origin 21. Where's Origin 21? Um, Where is Origin 21? Should be like right here. So 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. You know what? I'm going to head this way. I'm gonna head this way because 21 should be like right right in here somewhere we're just gonna go for it we're, maybe we're not close enough why would i not be able to see 21. <gasps> oh there we go okay all right we're back we're back we're good we're good uh we're gonna go 21. now i know people are like oh why do you keep going to 21 i could go to 24 you know it's like it's only 39 away but you know what 21's like my home plus it looks like a z1 you know kind of looks like a z1 i'm just saying we share a relationship like that <laughs> Well, hello there, Station 21. It's been a while. I feel like it's been a while. All right, we're going to come in here. We're not going to... I don't think we're going to dock or anything. I think our propellant's good. Everything's good to go. But we are going to... Uh, we're going to hop in here and try to sell some stuff, wheel and deal, make a little bit of cash money, and hopefully buy some of the ore that we need because I don't know where it's... I think it's outside the safe zone. And I'm not ready to travel there yet, I don't think. Okay, perfect. So we are within the station. Um, oh, I probably have to get out of the seat, don't I? In order to... 
Um, no, out. Thank you. Uh, let's go ahead and hop into here. Okay, so ores. We needed this. Oh my gosh, it's ten. Ugh, that is expensive. All right, we're gonna sell some. We're gonna do some stuff here. Uh, sell. What is the market price for this right now? Hold on, buy ores. Thirty nine. That's it. Um, hold on a second. I'm pretty sure it's more valuable to sell it to the. I think it's more valuable to sell it to the NPCs. You know, I didn't realize these buildings right here had ships for sale on them. It's kind of funny. I bet you those ones do too. Never even thought to look in those to be completely honest. All right, this is really, really close. Hoping that we stop. All right, so let's see what we got here. I think it, I think it's more valuable to sell. Oh no, it's not. It used to be. This was five thousand a stack before. Now it's thirty-eight ten. So they readjusted. They readjusted prices. interesting okay so that's unfortunate oh that's so expensive though it just keeps going up in price too so yeah, they're selling this for 3800 right now and even if i listed for 39.5 i'm pretty sure i would still be taking a loss so price per unit 39.5 Total price profit thirty five five. So no thirty five five is it's 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 better for me just to sell it to the NPCs. That's crazy. That's crazy. All right, so we're just gonna sell this to the NPCs because I mean I, I, I'm not gonna make any money that way. And if I want to sell it like real fast, which I want to sell it fast right now. I know people are gonna be like, oh, you could just, uh, I could list it at, you know, a much higher price, like all these other people are. However, these ones, like, they're not moving real quick. And I kind of need the money right now, unfortunately. So we're just gonna go ahead and we're just gonna sell this stuff. Okay, so what does that get me up to credits wise? 44. Okay, so that's pretty good. Um, let's go ahead and let's take a peek at another ore. What is this? A, a Gentile. Okay, hold on. What is the ore that I need to actually make this stuff? Valkite, char Chardium, and uh, so Valkite. So if I could not sell Valkite, that'd be ideal. Actually, you know what? I have a bunch of this uh, new Gite crystal. Let's see what that stuff's worth. 28. Uh, people are buying that up like crazy. 28. Hey, look! Or... Oh, wait, is that a full stack? It's not a full stack. 28, 27, 21. And after they take 10% off, I'm going to make more off of this. So I would make more by selling it this way uh, once again. All right, let's just sell this too. All right, that gets me up to 67. Okay, let's see how much is a Gisium ore we can buy. Oh, nine for 45. Uh, I'll buy that. Okay. All right, so we've got, we got five stacks. One, two, three, four, five at 9,000 a pop. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. I feel, I feel like that was pretty good. So how much is that actually gonna allow? 1728. So that means we have 8640 worth of that. Now, if I need to build, let's say, okay, so I know I need one, two, three, four, five, six. I need eight. I need eight corners. I know for a fact I need eight corners. Um, I'm not going to do walls. I'm going to leave everything open. I want to make it cheaper because I think this is going to be a little bit. Yeah, see, look at that. It costs like a whole bunch more. I don't need that. Um... So I need eight corners. So that's going to be 1220 ish of that Agis Agisium stuff. And then, oh, am 
my gosh, these floors are super expensive. Factory Hall Edge. Factory Hall Flat. So I'm guessing we have to run. So we run what? This? Or these? Oh, you know what? We might be running these. 152. Yeah, we're probably going to end up running these. We're probably going to end up running these and then these along the edge. And then these on the top. So actually, I need four of these, four of these, and then however long by however long I want to make it, and then fill with all these. Oh my gosh, we're going to need so much of this stuff. Okay, you know what? We're just going to take what we got. We're going to do what we can. We're going to get started. We're not going to get it done today. That's fine, but that's, you know what? We kind of knew that. We kind of knew that going into this. We're not finishing it today. There's a core right there. That's funny. All right, so let's pop out of here. Let's find my station, zone station. <laughs> I don't know why we can't have like numbers. Come on, Z1 station. <laughs> uh, I mean, I guess it's Z1, but still. All right. Let's go and turn turtle off and let's get out of here. Let's head back. So we're going to build what we can. Um, I think what I might actually try to do is I might try to build some floors first just to see if we can bolt our benches to it. I don't think we're going to be able to, but I kind of just want to try, you know, let's see what happens. Um, yeah we're good we're good you know we're not even there but it feels good to be home it feels good i'm hoping the station is still here <laughs> let's hope that the station is still here so uh, i was actually kind of thinking about it and i think what i might try to do what we're going to try to do the only reason i need a factory right now is to bolt the crafting benches onto right so we have three crafting benches so let's just make the room big enough for those three crafting benches and that's it. And if we make it that big, we might, yeah, we might be able to actually make it happen today. Also, we don't know if the factories even work currently because like people are saying that you build it and then you can't even enter like the, the area. But if we make it small enough to where we can stand next to the crafting benches, maybe, just maybe it'll work. <laughs> we'll see, we'll see. Um, okay, where's my station? I don't see it. Please have, please still be there. Really hoping it's not despawned. Oh, okay, good. It's there. It's there. Um, I think we're coming in a little hot here. All right, let's go into turtle mode and let's see. Where is the entrance to this at? Oh, I'm like coming up underneath of it. All right, we're going to enter this the correct ish way. We're going to come up here. We're going to turn. We're going to do one of these. And we're good. Now let's pull in. <laughs> you know, it's actually a lot smaller than it feels. Like, it feels like it's pretty big. Like, it feels like it's a pretty big room. But in actuality, it's pretty slow. It's pretty small. All right. So let's hop out of here. Um, now I did drop everything, so I don't have room to make anything. However, uh, yeah, actually, I, I there's really nothing. <laughs> I took all the ore out of here. So no. Guess who forgot to grab the ore out of the station before he came back? This guy. <sighs> okay. Okay, now this time, <laughs> this time I brought the ore back with us. <sighs> oh, I can't believe I did that. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Okay, so we're going to transfer all of our ores to the station, transfer all these out. But we need to go grab some charodium. Char char we need to go grab some charodium. So that's what we're going to go out and do now. Um, ores at the station. It looks good. And you know what? Actually, that looks like charodium right there. That might be... Let's take a peek. Hopefully it is because, um, well, you know what? We actually need quite a bit of it. Hey, look at that. I see a little red spot. So while I'm sitting here mining this stuff, I want to, uh, I want to talk, talk, kind of like talk about like what, uh, what my plan is, like what's going to go kind of go on here. Um, what I'm trying to do right now, because I know people are asking like, well, what's the point of building a base and all this stuff. I'm trying to build a base so that way we can kind of get like a, not I don't want to say like ahead of the curve, but I want to explore what this game has to offer currently in its current state and uh, kind of see like what's going on. So that way as like improvements are made, updates are made, you know, we can kind of follow along with it and kind of understand like, you know, the, the significance of the changes and stuff. 
also, um, I wanted a station because obviously like that's where we're going to be doing all our stuff out of. And I wanted it on the edge of the safe zone. So eventually we are going to probably pop out of the safe zone uh, and into the unsafe zone, I think, to, you know, to do, to do some collectings and goods and stuff like that. So yeah, like this is kind of like a stepping stone to get there. Now we could, I kind of talked about this in the live stream too. Uh, we could actually play not in the safe zone or like not in the we could we could just stay in the safe zone forever That's kind of an option that you would have instead of going out there We could just stay in here harvest materials here sell materials here and then just use the money and buy Stuff from people willing to risk their stuff going out into the, the terrible horrible awful world that is out there Now the problem with going out there is you can absolutely destroy your ship on anything what is this? This is ice and I don't need that right now. I'm not looking for you. Uh, you can destroy your ship on an asteroid. If you hit an asteroid, oh yeah, you can wreck your ship. Um, actually, I think I had somebody in the stream that commented like, yeah, I was all excited. I went out into the, uh, I exited the safe zone. I was out five minutes and then two hours, I hit an asteroid and then it was two hours later worth of work to get it back. Uh, and that's like, ooh, that's kind of the stuff that I'm worried about. But at the same time, like, it kind of sounds fun. I don't know. So we'll see. We'll see how it goes. I'm just kind of trying to open the door for a little bit of everything. And uh, we also need to do research and get things like that going. We need to get, um, I need to get some fuel rods made as well. But I was kind of hoping that I could get fuel rods made in, like, um, I was kind of hoping I could, like, build one of the, the fuel rod holders and put it on the station. Like, have, you know, fuel rods, like, chilling on the station. That'd be kind of cool. But I don't really know if that's a thing. So I think we would just have to, I, th I think we just have to throw them in our inventories. All right, let's head back. I got a little bit of ore. Um, I just want to kind of get building this stuff and see like how it goes. So like I said, I think we're going to, we're going to take out our, our chest. Well, actually let's build the pieces first. Let's see how big the pieces are. Because I'm, I'm thinking that maybe we're just going to build an area small enough to fit the three chests. And if we can bolt them down, awesome. That's a win. And then hopefully they'll stay on the station, but I don't know because people are, like I said, people are saying that once the, um, once the factory is built, that they're unable to, uh, they're unable to like go in it. So I'm kind of curious about that. Now, ideally I set up, um, I, this thing turns over very slowly. <laughs> I set up a whole area that I wanted to have the factory, but for testing purposes and, you know, trying to get things figured out and working up to it, we'll just, uh, we'll make it super teeny tiny. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and hit shut down. Let's hop out of here. Let's transfer our inventories over. Uh, transfer all or to there, there, there. Okay, cool. So let's see now. Yeah. Cause I made this whole area. I was gonna make this whole area a factory area, but oh my gosh. Those, uh, those factory pieces are quite expensive. All right, so we need our advanced crafting bench. Uh-oh. Okay, whew. Oh, I was worried. I was like, oh, no, did I not put it away? And then it just, like, it, it went away. Um, okay. So let's go ahead and put this on here. Just, can you, like, just click on real fast? Up. Oh. Thank you. Okay. So let's uh, put our pickaxe away before we hit anything else. And oh, wow, we can build 45 of those. That's crazy. Okay, so we need one, two, three, four of those. At least, at least. Now, I don't know. Is that a one by corner half? Is this a one by one area? Is this like a one by one by one? Or are we talking like a little bit bigger here? That's what I want to figure out. And then we're going to need some floors and whatnot too. So let's kind of wait and see what this, what the size of this is. Because I would say a workbench is, hold on. If we go in here and we pull a block, I go into easy build mode and pull this block out. A, a bench is what? One. It's like it's a block and a half okay so a workbench is a block and a half by by what like a block 
ish. Okay. So one and a half by one, and then there's three workbenches. So we'd have three. So about what? One and a half each. So three, four and a half. So maybe five long. Here, let's see here. Let's see how big this thing is. Okay, yeah, so it is only a one, it is a one by. So we would have to have probably one, a floor in one, and then like one, one floor, two floor, three floor, and then another one. So we need three floors by probably... one floor this way i think i think that would be enough i don't know we're gonna go we're gonna find out we're gonna find out we're gonna we're gonna figure this out okay so let's get into let's get back into crafting here so i want one two three let's get three of those first we actually have a lot more than i thought we did like we have the, we have the capability to make a lot more than I thought we did, but we don't have the capability to make this whole thing. This whole thing right here would be like a hundred. <laughs> it would be a lot. So also I did realize that why there's ramps is because these are actually meant to sit on top of floors. So I'm actually curious of how this is going to work if we're not sitting on top of a floor. You know what I mean? I wonder if we get out these one, two, three, how far in can we bring these? Actually, you know what? I'm not going to mess with that side. I'm only going to mess with this side right now. And we just did this kind of filled this area in. Cause I think this is where our stuff's going to end up being anyways. I wonder if I would need to bring out if I did that one and that one. Oh, they do actually line up pretty good, huh? They do actually line up pretty good. Okay, cool. Because I think we're going to have to have a floor kind of deal here. All right, so let's go with zero. Let's get these down here and let's kind of figure out what we're going here. So one there, one there. And one there. That's what I'm thinking that way wise, right? So then we're going to put these on the corners. Like that, and then like this. Then we're going to do another. Let's see, do we, have an, do we have another floor yet? We don't have another floor yet. So this is kind of what I'm thinking. It's a little, it's like I said, it's small right now. I'd like to do this entire floor, but that looks good. Okay. So there's three and then we need to do one. So we need one, two, three, four, five, five more and then three more. So we need eight more in total. Oh wait, no, we don't need eight more of those. We need one, two, one, two, three, and then we need one, two, three, just floors. Because those are going to be like the middle part of it. And then we are going to need these as well to do the tops. Uh, to like close it in and make it the box, you know? Uh, but I don't want to do that yet. I want to get the floors in and I want to see if we can bolt stuff to it, you know? See if we can be fancy, fancy bolt stuff to it before it becomes a room. Or if we're gonna have to make it a room first. Hmm. So we got another platform. We're gonna go one right here. And then we can do another corner. Right there. And then do we have another floor now? Heck yes, we do. Because the green line is marking the border. That's why I only needed three regular floors in the middle. Because we need we need three of the lined floors and then three regular floors and then we should be good. Minus the tops, minus the tops, of course, because we're gonna need the 
top piece, top piece, top piece, top piece, and then rails, I believe, all the way across those. You know, are these making us a bunch of points right now? What are we getting uh, points-wise? 173 uh, box points and then 18 mechanical points. That's kind of good. That's kind of good. Uh, we do have we have all kinds of points right now, too. So I'm thinking that we're probably going to go with... I really want to get tools and weapons going. I really want to get tools and weapons going. Um, we already have the ability to make fuel rods. And like I said, uh, a lot of the stuff in here, I can't really do anything with. Because like buildings kind of, kind of, you know, borked. <laughs> but this stuff, what is this? Solar panels? What does that do exactly? What is, what is that thing? What is that beam right there? I don't know. I'm kind of curious. Okay. So we can get these ones finished. One, two, three. Okay. So there's that area. But like I said, we have to bring this up, connect it in. We have to get the top part done too, because we have to have a full box. Kind of like this. We have to have these parts of this. Okay, so what are the odds that we can actually bolt these to this? Um, no, not that one. Eight. You. Uh what? Hey. You're not correct. Wait, what? Huh. Wait, so that's a wall. How do we fill in the middle? What? Hold on a second. What is going on here? This should be the floor. There's no way we need these. That's the edge. Factory hall flat Z. Can be used as a floor or wall piece when building factory halls. Hmm. Something seems a little off here. Oh, it worked there. Oh, okay. You know what? So I must have just had I must have had it rotated the wrong way. Okay. Alright, so now it comes the fun. Turn off build mode. Grab this. We're gonna see if we can throw this on here. Like that. Can I bolt you down now? Oh, I got one. And it's, I mean, it's not going to go anywhere. Weird that I can't only do, uh, it's weird that I can only do one. Okay, hold on a second. Let's get this bad boy in here. Okay. Interesting. This one won't let me do it. <gasps> okay, I got one. It's weird. It's only letting me put one bolt in each one. But I mean, they're bolted down. They're bolted down. They're there. Uh, the only workbench I'm missing is the tools one. And I don't think I have the stuff to make the tools one. Advanced tools. What am I missing? Uh, Charodium. Okay. Yeah. So I'm missing that one. But these ones are definitely here. So, you know what? Whilst... Oh, you know what? Shoot. Yeah. I kind of messed up the crafting a little bit here. Um, okay. Okay because I had things queued and then oh no one two three four oh no they're all done okay so let's do this let's go get some charodium let's get the other bench and let's try to get it in here and bolt it down I don't know why I can only throw one bolt on though that's really weird but I mean it is bolted down question is will it stay there it should well let me weld let me weld it okay i mean they're on there we didn't finish the factory they're definitely on there 
Okay. Yeah, let's go get some charodium. Uh, so we can get a tools one in here. Let's get a tools one in here. We'll throw a bolt in it, I guess. And then we'll finish it. And so what I think is going to happen is once we finish it, it's going to put a force field around it. We're not going to be able to get in. However, I'm hoping that we'll be close enough to at least use them until we can figure out how to get in here and actually do stuff. So I'm going to leave those like that because they are one bolt there, one bolt there. They shouldn't fly away. They shouldn't go anywhere. Should be good to go. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, let's go get some more charodium, charodium, charodium stuff. All right, so we got some more of the goods. So let's go ahead and throw all these in there. And let's hope that our crafting bench has stayed. <laughs> they were bolted down. We had a bolt them. They shouldn't have got anywhere. They're still there. Okay. All right, so uh, let's go ahead and let's craft up a one of those and we'll get that going and then we'll start actually we can go ahead and start throwing the tops on here we're just not going to connect everything until uh until we're done so put that in here so up here uh oh we gotta be an easy build mode for this all right let's go ahead and take gravity off real quick need to flip you like that like that, like this, and like that. Okay, so there's those. Now we need these guys. So I believe one, two, three, one there, one there, one there, and one here. And we're not going to do the last one yet. Not doing the last one yet. Because I don't want this to become a room quite yet. I want to get my other thing in here first. <laughs> you know what I mean? We got we to get our, uh, our tool and weapons crafting bench in here first. And hopefully a bolt through it. And then we're going to click that. And then that should make this a factory room. Should. Okay, so our tool crafting bench is done. And you know what? I'm actually thinking maybe we should go ahead and build another... Uh, basic crafting bench in the event <laughs> in the event that these become broken and we lose them somehow so i'm gonna go ahead and craft up one of those as well uh but since it's queued we should be good to go let's go ahead and let's grab our tools workbench uh no in here yes and then here perfect let's see if we can get this guy in here actually um can we get you like right in between these? Like, okay, so that looks good, but can we get a bolt in you? <gasps> yes, we can. Well, we can only get one, which is really weird. I don't know why I can only get one bolt in it, but um, okay, here it is. Here's the time that we've all been waiting for. We're gonna go ahead. We're gonna put this in here. Now, I had thought about standing in here when I do this, but I don't know. Let's stand on the outside and let's go from there. Uh, oh, yep. There is a force field and there's some boxes. Okay. So we can't get in here. Wait, yes, we can. Uh, okay, we're going to do a test here. Let's grab a bolt gun. Oh, I can't remove that now. Ooh, I can't pull those out. Can I pull any of these out? Where was the bolt on this one? Wasn't it like right here? It doesn't want me to pull it out. Okay. So let's do this. Oh, you know what? I was in an easy build mode. I want to do a test. Okay. I can't pick this up. Why can't I pick you up?
And now I can't bolt it down. Why can't I pick you? Oh, easy build mode. On? Off. Okay, are we welded? No. Weird. Not exactly sure what's going on with this one. Okay, it's floating. Can we push it out of here? <laughs> okay, well, those are obviously staying. Let's push it out of this area, maybe? No. Why are you causing issues? I can't grab it. Okay, so I'm going to do this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to log out. I'm going to log back in because I had this issue before. Uh, but I think what's going to happen is we're actually going to probably lose this crafting bench. Oh. Crafting bench is still here. I can walk in and out of this, no problem. Okay, let's grab this. I want to pull this out of here. And I want to try placing it. Okay, so we got it. Okay, so that's out. So why is there still a box there? That's kind of weird. Okay. So that's there. I now have this in my inventory. And we have this like weird shaped box. I think that box was from the crafting bench. So um, if I go back and place. Oh. I'm just kind of seeing how this works here. Okay, so if I place this... Whoa, what? No. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's upside down. I'm pretty sure we want it this way. Okay, so there's that. I put more than one in now. <gasps> yes. We did it. We got it. Okay. Wait, what the heck? Did I have two of those? No. Okay, that's weird. All right, let's do the same thing here. Pick those up. I think we've done it. I think we've finally done it. Okay, so those are there. Let's go ahead. Let's grab... We need advanced crafting bench and basic. So there's one. There's the other. Uh, no. You, why, why you do that? Why you do that? It like flips over completely upside down. Like all weird like. One. Oh my gosh. I can't believe this actually works. People have been saying for so long it doesn't work. It works. <laughs> we did the things. Oh my gosh, we did the things. We did the things. We did the things. Okay. Uh, this one, I'm going to have it a different way. Because I need to be able to get into it. Oh, hey. No, you're in the wrong spot. Because like the, the bolt down spots are kind of weird. One. Oh my gosh.
We've done it. And I don't know what I did, but people were saying that they didn't have access to their halls. Um, I have access to my hall. And now we have all of the crafting stuff in one area. Oh my gosh, this is so exciting. So now we can craft up. Basically, I can stand here. I can craft anything um, because we have... Requires basic crafting match. Oh, I have to be closer to the crafting? What? Okay, so I guess I'd have to be over here on this side. So yeah. So we have to stand like at the bench that we're at. But still, oh my gosh. Actually, you know what we should do? You know what? Since uh, since things are actually working right now, let's go ahead and do this. Let's do this instead. I want to try getting access to all benches at one time. So let's grab you. Put you into inventory. Let's grab this guy. Into inventory. Grab this guy. Let's give me our first one. Okay, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna put it like right here. Uh, let's see, that's kinda perfect. All right, so there's that one. So basically what I want to do is I want to come up right here and then I want eight, seven and eight. Okay, so I want another one right here. Hey, nope, you're in the wrong spot there, guy. And now you're like all upside down and weird. <laughs> all right, so I want one there. And then I want the other one, obviously, on the other side. So hopefully, we're all next to all of them. All right. So there. Now we have, boom. We should. Let's see. Okay. So we have ship modules, um, personal tools, crafting benches, uh, station parts. Oh, hold on. Station modules, factory modules, station modules. We can craft everything from right here. We can do it. We can craft everything. We have all of our benches in one spot. Oh my gosh. We've done it. We've done We've done it. Okay. So now let's see if we go in here and we go to stations. Here's my station. View station. Halls. Here's our factory hall. Now I don't think that we can do anything with it. Construction. Building permission. Deconstruction permission. So this is where people were having issues is because they couldn't figure out how to get access to their own hall. And if you remember when I first built it, we were actually stuck on it. We couldn't go through it. And then I don't, I don't know. I just, I took off, I ran through it <laughs> and it worked. So I don't know. I don't know what caused it, but um, we're here. We're in our hall. Maybe it's just working now. Maybe they did a bug fix. Maybe you have to like build a new hall and like maybe, you know, in order for changes to take effect, it has to be in a new hall. I don't know, but you know what? We've got benches. We've got workbenches in here. I'm super excited, and that's going to end this episode. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you leave a like. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe as well for some more. If you have any comments, leave a comment down below. Uh, it does help with the channel. And yes, oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited that we got this to work. Now we can do all of the things. We can do research. We can start building some stuff. Uh, basically, I want to start getting some stockpile of like tools and weapons and like all this stuff. I want to get all the things going, you know? But thank you so much for coming out. Have a wonderful rest of your day, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.